What's up? Hey, what's up? So I scoured the internet looking for all the worst tattoos I could find. And here's what I found. First, we'll start with this one. Once you go black, you never go back. And I heart Africa. You know, I have a hunch that this girl, she might be into black guys. The really funny part is her boyfriend's wife. Here's a face tattoo. This might look like he's bruised up, but no, that's a tattoo. Why would you want a tattoo on your face, making it look like you got your ass kicked? You really want everybody to think you got your ass kicked every single day of your life? People must come up to him and be like, oh man, what happened? That's really bad. And you'll be like, oh no, don't worry, I didn't get my ass kicked. It's just a tattoo. And then they're like, I would have respected you more if you got your ass kicked. And if a zombie apocalypse happens, this guy's fucked. He's so fucked. People are gonna be shooting at him like crazy. Here's a girl that's easy. Being easy isn't really something a girl should be proud of. Unless you're just desperately seeking attention and your ultimate goal in life is to impress horny men who won't take you seriously. Now this next one I can't really explain. There's nothing wrong with the tattoo and the artist is fine. It's just fucking weird. I just don't understand what's going on here. If you can explain it to me, please do. Maybe I just don't know what she's trying to show here. I don't know. Is it like a sex thing or is it is it from a movie? At least it's well done. But why? I just don't... Alright, I mean, if that's what you want to put on half your body, then yeah, sure, more power to you. Here's an Arnold tattoo, and I severely hope that this tattoo isn't finished. It's like they were trying to capture Arnold in VHS quality. Here's a Native American embracing a corn dog. That is the creepiest Native American I have ever seen. And suddenly, I never want a corn dog again.